Hey y'all, Merry Christmas. Just wanted to pop on here, say hello. Uh, I'm sure a lot of y'all have heard about interest rates coming down a little bit last week and everybody's interested in what they're gonna do over the next couple of weeks. And while we don't know, what we can do is start to prepare for your next home purchase um, because it is gonna be, and it is a good time to buy a house currently. Um, so what, what do you do? What is your first step in purchasing a home? Whether it is your first time buying a home, whether you've bought multiple homes, whether you're buying an investment home, what is your first step? Your first step is you want to find a really good agent. You want to find somebody who knows the market that you're going to buy in, um, that they are a neighborhood expert or they're willing to become a neighborhood expert um, in that area. What does that mean? They, that means they're not afraid to knock on somebody's door and ask them if they're selling their home or if they know anybody that's selling their home. They're not afraid to send postcards. They're not afraid to make calls in those areas to help you find your um, your next home. Um, the next thing you want to make sure is you want to make sure they know other agents. For example, I work in an office with over 400 agents and we have a market share in the Birmingham area, which means if there is a home um, coming soon, I'm sometimes I'm one of the first to know about it um, in the area that you're looking in before it's even put online. So you want to make sure they know their agents and that they have good relationships with them. Um, you want to make sure they have experience. You want to uh, know that they have um, closed a few deals and they know how to work through the various different problems that you're going to encounter or challenges that you definitely encounter um, in every in every purchase. Um, some are harder than others, but you want to make sure that they are um, a problem solver and have resources to help you um, navigate through this um, this process. And the next thing you want to do, you want to make sure that they're committed to working with you. You know, are are they committed to helping you see you through your goal? No matter how long it takes, no matter your budget, um, make sure they're committed to working with you. And then definitely the last thing I would say is you want to make sure that they are well connected with other vendors in the area, with title attorneys, with, um, with insurance companies, with contractors. You know, there are so many different, um, so many different people that you need when you're preparing to sell your house or when you're buying a house and you need repairs or updates or, you know, you, you, there are so many people that you need and um, your realtor should be a resource for you. Um, which leads me to what I would love to talk about next time um, would be lenders. Why is it important to choose a local lender? Um, they are they are the one of the most important people in this entire process in addition to your agent so stay tuned for that and i hope you guys have a great day bye